In today's first reading, the Lord speaks to Solomon. Ask something of me, and I will give it to you. Rather than asking for riches and a long life, Solomon humbly asks for an understanding heart. This becomes a real treasure for you. The gospel of him compares the kingdom of God to a great treasure buried in a field and a pearl of great price. We come together now to celebrate the living presence of God, a treasure revealed to us in the words of Scripture and in the Eucharist we share. Our presider for today's Mass is Father Joe Shemmon. Please stand and come. From the first book of Kings, the Lord appeared to Solomon in a dream at night. God said, Ask something of me, and I will give it to you. Solomon answered, O oh Lord, my God, you have made your servant king to succeed my father David, but I am a mere youth, not knowing at all how to act. I serve you in the midst of the people whom you have chosen, a people so vast that it cannot be numbered or counted. Give your servant, therefore, an understanding heart to judge your people and to distinguish right from wrong. For who is able to govern this vast people of yours? The Lord was pleased that Solomon had made this request. So God said to him, because you have asked for this, not for a long life for yourself, nor for riches, nor for the life of your enemies, but for understanding, so that you may know what is right. I do as you request it. I give you a heart so wise and understanding that there has never been anyone like you now. And after you, there will come no one to equal you. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. The refrain for our response soil song. Lord, I love your command. 